And thank you for tuning in to WSKI Channel 17 Weather Report, brought to you by Geppettos. You can check them out in Sugarloaf's Village West. And your weather for Thursday, April 6th, we have temperatures at the summit just around 30 degrees and base temperatures in the upper 30s. Uh, summit winds should be 25 to 40 miles per hour. Might affect the lifts up there, but uh, base winds are pretty mellow uh, with gusts over 30 and afternoon sleet. Uh, cloudy and chance of showers tomorrow, Friday, April 7th, we have high temperatures up at the top, uh, mid 30s, mid to upper 30s, and base temperatures just around 40, maybe even up to 45. Uh, winds should be pretty mellow. Uh, considerably more mellow than today. Uh, Saturday, April 8th, we have some AM showers and possible mix. Uh, highs around 43. And Sunday and Monday should be a redemption for the current weather we're dealing with. But uh, we're going to have temperatures just around almost 50 degrees on Sunday, sunny skies. And your trail report for Thursday, April 5th, is brought to you by Birchwood Interiors. 154 trails and trail sections available for you, 51 of which were groomed. Current conditions out there, packed powder, loose granular. Uh, it was a really nice day yesterday, so it should still be pretty nice out there. The groomers went out on Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, King's Landing, as well as Comp Hill, uh, Spillway, Gundy Line, Pipeline, and Wedge. Candyside, Lower Winter's Way, Boardwalk, The Landing, The Birches, and Snowbrook also got groomed out. And as we head over to the east side of the mountain, you can see that uh, Widowmaker Ram down Two Hall and Whiffle Tree. Also, uh, Slasher Rollaway and Moose Alley got grouped. On to the west side, Scoot and Good Chance Crosscut, as well as the Trade Park, Sidewinder, uh, Haywire, Skybound, and Stomping Grounds. At 8.30 this morning, we have Snubber, Skidway, and Sawduster available for you, getting access to that beginner terrain down by the Base Lodge area uh, and Snowbrook area as well. Joining the pack at 8.30, we have Double Runner East, getting you a little bit further up the mountain. Still that beginner terrain on Boardwalk, Lower Winter's Way, and Lower Narrow Gauge, as well as PV Crosscut. Super Quad and Skyline are going to open up at 8.30 this morning as well, getting access to some of that more advanced terrain, where you get up to actually some double black diamonds off of Skyline. And then at 9 o'clock, we have King Pine and Whiffle Tree uh, scheduled to open, and that'll get you some beginner terrain off Whiffle Tree, and King Pine is more advanced stuff. At 9 o'clock as well, we have Timberline joining, uh, and that should open without issue today. We might have visibility issues up there. It's going to be a little foggy, but it should still be a nice ride. Make sure you tune into Reggae Fest. Uh, today we have uh, some music up at the Widowmaker Lounge, and then tomorrow night we have John Brown's Body in the King Pines Room, as well as another uh, dub cartel in the Widowmaker. As always, we're WSKI. You can check us out at WSKITV.com or on Facebook at WSKITV. Give us a follow over on Twitter at WSKITV17 or on Instagram at WSKITV. We're independently owned and operated by Snowfields Productions since 1986. Also, check us out for wa our final Watch and Win this Sunday from 7.30 to 9 a.m. where we pull a, a name of a hat from all the winners of this season and they get a pair of amalgam skis.